Well, what's up guys? It is Pip here and I'm back, by the way. Sorry for not stepping in at all during the playoffs. Um, I was busy. I was busy moving. I have moved finally and that's all out of the way. So let's just not even worry about it. But we're back. We're back to making content. I'm sorry. And this is a sad way to start it. This is a very sad way to start this. Andrew Cagliano retires after a long years in the playoffs. He was drafted in 2005 to the Edmonton Oilers, 25th overall, first round, 25th pick. He, he was, I mean, it was, I mean, he wasn't big, but he was still first round. It's Andrew Cagliano. But let's just look through his an amazing career. So he was drafted. He didn't play in the NHL until 2007 to the Edmonton Oilers. Played that season, 2007-2008. Um, he hit I mean, he had a good start. 18 goals, 27 assists, 45 points overall in that year. I mean, he did pretty good. 20, 20 penalty minutes, though. He does keep it. He does keep it normal. But he only had 13 minutes played during that season. But honestly, it's not too bad. He played all 82 games. Now this is crazy. I'm just realizing this now. So through the 2007, 2008, 2008, 2009, 2010, 2009, 2010. 2010s, 2011, 2011 to 2012, he played all 82 games. Holy cow. This man was a tank. <laughs> he did not care. And then, 2011 to the 2012, he was traded to the Anaheim Ducks. He did play all 82 games that year, too. Um, he had 13 goals, 13 assists, 26 points. He didn't do the best, it looks like, that year. Um, yeah. Didn't really, he didn't play much too at 14 minutes. I mean, he, he, he was okay. He had, he had 115 shots. He did have shots on net, but definitely wasn't his best. Clearly he did stay on Anaheim for, wow, a lot more years. Holy cow. He played a lot more than I thought. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight years in Anaheim until 2018, 2019. That year he did, he played. 46 games, not not a whole season. Probably had a big injury then. He only had three goals. Yeah, that 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 was the trade point right here. Three goals, eight assists, 11 points overall. Yikes, yikes, buddy. Yeah, that's that's when the injury hit. That's when he had a. He probably that's why he got traded. 13 minutes played. He didn't play the best. He, he it with the injury definitely did hurt his career. Um, but then. He got traded to Dallas in 2018-2019 with 32 games played, even less games played, with three goals, three assists, and six points. I got to see what he got injured for there. He had to have some huge injury. That's a yikes. I I got to see what happened. But he was in Dallas 2019-2020, 2020-2021 through those COVID years. 68 games played on 2020. Um, 50, 54, 20, 20, 20, and 21 games. But look at those, look at the stats. I mean, he really didn't show up too much there in Dallas. He kind of struggled, it looks like. Then he got traded to San Jose in 2021, 2022 for 56 games played, four goals, 11, 11 assists, 15 points. Still not the best. He was a minus 16 that year. Still not the best. But then, but then, but then, I mean, in my opinion, his career turned around here. His first year for Colorado in 2021, 2022, he didn't play many games. We get traded. He tr traded to. I think we did. Did we trade for him or did we get it off of free agency? I don't remember. I'd have to look that up. But he only played 18 games. Zero goals, one assist, one point. Nothing. He had nothing the whole year. That year, it was. He had a. He was either just not playing or he was injured it was one of those it i have no idea how to look it up again but it's whatever but then 2022 2023 games i mean it's it's definitely not his best time of the year because he had 21 goals in 2013 i mean this was definitely his peak year it's kind of sad to say it his beginning years were his peak because then you go down here 2022 2023 he had only had tw 10 goals nine assists 19 points but but i do have to say this he won a cup i know i think he won a cup with anaheim i'm pretty sure he won a cup between here i think he has two cups on his belt i believe so because he didn't win with dallas because he got knocked out with dallas but i mean I, that's a to me that's a great way to retire he he has cups on his belt 
He did good. He played amazing for us all throughout these two years here. I mean, he didn't, he, yikes. But for the two years he played for us, he played amazing. I do have to say that. He, he, he does play amazing. For his whole career, though, 1,294 games, 190 points, 274 assists, and 464 points overall. Oh, yeah. He was a plus 31 in his whole career, full, full career and 451 battle minutes. You love to see it. You love to see it. And overall, in total shots, was 1,934. Uh, yeah, yeah. He's, he's, he's had an amazing career. I do have to say that. He, he has an amazing career. He's had an amazing career. I do applaud him for having what he has. Um, but now, the huge thing is... I mean, he played pretty dang good. He played good for the for our whole years um, with us, and I mean, I'm proud of him. The good thing is, is he does. I'm I'm kind of happy about this. After winning the cup with Colorado, he decides to stay in Colorado for one more year for this season, and then after this season, he retires. And this, and guess what he does? He joins the front office of Colorado Avalanche. I'm 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 happy about that. I'm happy that he just didn't you know leave. He just kind of he just accepted it. I mean, I'm, I'm proud of him for that. He's, he's a huge, he's a huge piece in the Carlisle Avalanche, and he's gonna be a huge piece in the front office. I'm excited about that. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, please go congratulate um Andrew Cagliano in, in on Instagram, on Twitter, or whatever you want to say. Go congratulate him. He has an amazing career. He he's been an amazing player all across any team he's played for. He's been amazing. So go congratulate him. And yeah, um, happy retirement. Andrew Cogliano, and I hope you come in, and, uh, well, of course, you're going to be at the games, you're going to have front office, brand new job, you're going to love it, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys are subscribed, make sure, make sure that notification bell is always on for future videos coming out, uh, trade, uh, draft is coming up, I'll, we'll, I'll make a video on that, um, trade deadline, not trade deadline, uh, free agency is coming up, uh, sign up Stanley Cup, uh, it's going to game six right now. Have not made a video about any of these, but I will make a video, a full video on the playoffs and my thoughts on them. But, but yeah, I'll do that. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you guys next time. Congratulations, Andrew Cagliano.